it was good YouTube uh, as you can see in the title villains I want to be talking about Cell and I wanted to do this now because there's nobody here and when people come I can't record there's a zoo up in here you already know anyway so I'm gonna get so many thumbs down so much hate because in my opinion so is overrated I don't hate Cell, but I, the character I really don't like the saga I liked the saga I liked how mysterious it was whose time machine is this but my mom only did one time machine why is there another one what's going on it was mysterious I liked it the saga was great it was where Goku was at his best in my opinion Goku was a genius a genius in that saga like he was just like a step, step ahead of everyone out of everyone like he knew the outcome Goku was a genius in that saga but when it comes to again hey the title villains we're not here to talk about Goku when it comes to Cell I don't like the character like think about it what was what was Cell's reasoning to for, for doing all of this he has Freezer cells, he has the Saiyan cells, so he wants a good fight. The computer told him if he absorbed 17 and 18, that he would be the perfect fighter. So, in his mind, that's what he wanted to do. But you also see that Free that, that Cell, he didn't follow what Jero said, or programmed, or made him to, to, to be. Normally, Jiro would create an android or someone to kill Goku. Well, Cell didn't really want it to kill. I mean, he didn't give a damn. He wanted a good fight. After he was perfect, he just he wanted a good fight. And he knew that Goku was the only one that could give him a great, exciting fight. That's all he wanted. But here's the thing. What he wanted after that. He was going to destroy Earth after that what after you destroy earth well, what are you gonna do you go to another planet what are you gonna do the same thing 10 days I'm gonna do cell games find the fight the, the strongest fighter and, and join the tournament and if I kill them all I'm gonna destroy this planet and what if he did you're gonna destroy the next planet and the next planet and the next planet and the next one until what there's no more planets and like you, you, you see where I'm going here it, it, it's like you have a villain that is not thinking well what he's going to do I mean that could be the Saiyan cell in him but it looks like he didn't really get the the the, the Frieza cells because Frieza was a way in my opinion a way better villain I explained that before Frieza did his thing because he had a reason to do it if he destroyed a planet it's not because I'm gonna destroy it because I want to no, I'm gonna destroy it because I feel like I kind of have to planet Vegeta yeah these guys are getting kind of strong you know just to be careful I gotta destroy the whole planet sorry guys see that's what Frieza does he didn't go out there let me just blow up everything what I'm gonna do after there's no no plan is no life forms. I'm just gonna stand here and 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 float in the universe, empty space. You see what I'm you, you see what I'm saying? Frieza didn't do none of that. He wanted power. He had an empire. He he, he it was like a businessman. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Sell none of that, none of that. And again, you could blame the saying um cells in him, but. Again, the character, is, to me, is not appealing to me. I really don't like it. He's overrating. He's overrated, in my opinion. So, what else can I say? I mean, 
I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna be like, fuck you, thumbs down, and, and, and a lot of hate, but hey, what can I say, that's just my opinion. And, yeah, that's all. The next video, as you guys know, yep, is about that Majin Buu. Uh, so we'll get to that in the next video, so, peace.